I'm going to use this uh, Thermaltic uh, mid tower case and as you see it comes with the uh, uh, mesh uh, nice uh, design at the front and I like this at the top the dock SATA uh, station where you can insert your uh, hard drive and basically if we look inside we have I like this because it's easy to remove and lock and eliminate the uh, noise and also vibration and it's it has a heaps of uh, depth to to uh, mount a big high-end motherboard and you can see the area where the CPU you can have even uh, a bigger uh, heatsink uh, CPU fan if you are going to use uh, uh, that in your uh, system build and I like the back of the case you have the uh, fan mounted already and we have heaps of slots to add and this is where the power supply I'm going to install the 500 watt and if we look on the top it's also you see there is 200 millimeter fan at the top to blow the air out so as far as the air circulation in this case uh, I think is is very good for this type of motherboard and that's what you need to consider when you build a system in this level how the air circulation for si your system will work so you have to choose something that uh, very uh, efficient to uh, boost the life cycle of your computer uh, further so I have this hard drive this is how it looks like so I can just mount it inside as you see and just you press that's it so now you have your hard drive connected direct to the SATA uh, interface inside the computer and basically um, this uh, SATA it has the wire it will be connected to the motherboard so you basically you connect uh, your hard drive external you don't need to buy additional uh, dock station so if you have an old computer and you want to uh, access the hard drive or if you want to copy files or something it's handy to have this uh, attached to the case this is the system as you see the card reader the USBs and the DVD installed and we have as you see inside the hard drive is there ready to go with Windows uh, 7 next I have to tie these wires at the back next here we go the computer is installed and as you see just to see the current system configuration so we have that's the C drive the 2 terabyte and we can see here the device manager the 8 gig RAM and I, uh, as you see also I'm doing the system uh, drivers uh, setup I'm using the USB on the card reader I installed the back of the computer and as you see we have here um, the wireless um, card installed so basically this is connected now to the internet using um, the wireless uh, card I installed you can see here it's connected